think what, what Carol was saying, uh, I'm here to get a prosthesis man. I heard about Sondage through a friend who works for Merlin. Just, just talk about it. Ohio, 26 years old, and I lost my leg 19 years ago due to a gunshot accident. Um, this is basically the first time I've had a prosthesis. I tried one when I first had my accident. It didn't work out. It was much too heavy and uh, didn't fit right. So I found out about Savage through a friend um, who works at a Merle Norman studio. I too work at a Merle Norman studio. I own one. I've been with Merle Norman for eight years and uh, decided I wanted to come out and see if I could learn to walk again. I've been on crutches all this time and um, been having trouble with my arms. Uh, have my prosthesis on now. It feels good. I've been able to walk with it. I think it's something I can stick with. Um, very comfortable. Um, I'm slow right now walking, but I'm sure I can uh, get better if I get used to it. But in 19 years ago, I was fitted as a hip disarchic. Um, around the waist. It was very uncomfortable. Um, here at Savage, I have been fitted with a suction socket. Um, I have a very short limb and I do use a small belt in case the suction does not hold, but so far it's um, been working. These are the crutches that I've been using. And um, they tend to put a lot of pressure on the wrist, which sometimes causes metacarpal tendril syndrome. At work, I know I'm going to enjoy having my hands free. Um, sometimes it gets really cumbersome to have these on your arms all the time, especially when you're uh, working with people and using brushes and everything. So this way I will have my hands free. Not to mention I won't be standing on my leg with all my weight on one leg. Um, my leg gets really tired at times and uh, starting to get varicose things so I'm getting more help out on that somewhat. Um, I've been here at Savage for a little over three weeks now. Um, my husband JV came with me and he's been my coach. First few days I got really depressed, <laughs> but um, he's been there and he keeps me up all the time. So uh, he really helps me. Um, he helps me when I walk. He can, you know, tell if I'm too stiff with my arms or not putting my weight on the leg right. Um, just little things like that. So when someone's watching you, they can see you walk so that they can kind of coach you along. And it's nice being here with someone that you're close to because um, sometimes the days can get long and you get really tired. So um, it's been really nice having him here with me. It would be really nice um, that Sherry has this prosthesis now because we've never been able to hold hands. And um, when we were on our honeymoon, the first time we tried to walk down the beach and. Uh, Terry's crutches stuck down in the sand and we lost the tips on them and uh, so that was kind of traumatic so um, we're anxious to try it again and see how it works but uh, there's a lot of things that we'll be able to do and um, one thing that Sherry wanted to do was to be able to slow dance and we'll be able to do that now and uh, I think it's going to change her lives a lot. Uh, she's been more mobile now and I won't have to trip over her crutches anymore <laughs> in the morning hopefully and during the day so um, I think it's really going to help out a lot. Okay, to take off the limb, um, I do have a belt, so I just loosen the belt that holds it around my waist securely. Press the button for the suction to let the suction go. And just slowly kind of rock my way out of the socket. short amputation from the socket. It's real, 
relatively easy to get off. It's not too hard to get on once you get the hang of the full stop. They even made me a tush in the back. Kind of even everything out. Um, they put a little flap over the back where the hydraulics are. And I think Bobby did a really nice job on the shape and the color. So the two piece cover over the one piece cover mainly because I want to be more active. Um, I want to be able to get down on the floor and play with the kids and not have to worry uh, about bothering or, or misshaping the one piece cover. And I want to try to be more active in sports. I want to, never been in sports, but I want to try something. I don't know what yet, but uh, I do plan on being active with it, so that's really the reason I opted for the two piece. That's where enough. The cameras. Okay, that's good enough. Sideways a bit if you can. That's it, yeah. Good. Bend it again. Bend it. Good. Yeah. Turn around again. And now sort of tilt the socket towards me. So that's the idea. Yeah. Good. And now just pretend you're putting it on. Just See, all, all these people will dub in when, you, when you're talking through the sound. Mm -hmm. okay. And just sort of turn this. Turn all the way around if you can, face the wall. Hang on a second. Okay. Just drop it off. Okay. You might need to leave a little bit early. Yeah, leave, leave close at five. Yeah. Okay. And I've told her all this stuff we should have dub in when she's she's been yeah. talking, she's been telling her story. Okay, it's good. You can slip it off again. It's really helpful to people. The same by Gabrielle for us. It yeah. really is. That's good. Yeah, hang on a second. Zoom in on that. Believable. That's yeah, put the process yeah. a little further. Oh, I like that, yeah. yeah. Put the process a little further to the side if you can. She can sure. do it, I can do it kind of deal. I hate to ask you to do this, but just just to take about three hops the other way. Which just yeah, just this hop. No, well, you can just. What are you just doing? Normally, just. Hey, we'll, 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 we'll just we'll just plug that in. Oh, hi, hop. Yeah. Just just hop, hop there and through. Okay, that's it. And just go a little further and come back again. Pick up your crutches and go with your crutches. And just go back to work the plants again. That's all.
one thing you might want to do is look for something silky. We've been looking for something that is that is smoother, that isn't it's not so rough as that sock. We haven't been able to find it, but maybe you're the Thank you. 